Premier League game for you today. I'm Martin Tyler, and to call the action alongside me, Alan Smith. And our match today, Arsenal against Sunderland. Tell us what you think about this Arsenal team. Well, this is a talented outfit, no doubt about it. Possible champions this season in my book, and uh, a chance here for them to get into the swing of it in terms of the tactics and the shape. Interesting it'll be today. Number 20, Shotman Mustafi. Number 6, Lauren Deshaunli. Just wondering what we're going to see today. Meza Ozil, can we focus on him? Yeah, he can score goals without question, and he can also make them. He's got a wonderful eye for a pass, slotting them through tight avenues. This is the Arsenal lineup. And the check starts in goal. Monreal starts alongside Hector Bellerin in the fullback position. Granit Xhaka starts with Aaron Ramsey in the centre of the pitch. Danny Welbeck is the sole striker today. This is the Sunderland team for you today. Billy Jones starts with Brian Oviedo as the fullbacks. Adnan Yanuzai starts with Fabio Barini in the wide positions. Jermaine Defoe is the sole striker today. When Arsenal moved here, they put up the dates of the club's successes around the stadium. But for a while, there was nothing that had actually happened since the Emirates had been the home ground. But of course, in 2014 and 2015, they won the FA Cup on both occasions, and they'll be hoping that opens the floodgates in that respect. Yeah, I think that's what this ground is missing. History, matches that you can look back on when maybe you clinch the league. Uh, if they can add that to this uh, fantastic stadium, then it really will feel like home and something to replace Hybe with. It's a good way to nick the ball back. Quick thinking. Yanuzai. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Got the tackle in. Looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. Here's Walcott. Shots on here. But he's caught offside. You see what he's trying to do, it's all about the timing of the run. Manager won't be too happy with that. Now, last. Good reading of the play, anticipating the pass. A timely challenge, Aaron Ramsey. It's Mesut Ozil now, in a dangerous area. Just working away to try and find an opening. Well back! He's a great team player, Danny Welbeck, but he gets his share of goals for himself as well. And this is in typical Danny Welbeck fashion. Keeper almost got there, but it wasn't a strong enough touch. Yeah, he's annoyed with himself, isn't he? Having got a touch on it, feels he should have done better. So the first goal, it's 1-0. To Jones. That's a free kick against Ozil. Well, the ref's given a foul here, and it's a bad one, yellow. Yeah, no surprise there at all. Here's Walcott. There's some potential in this move. And it will go into the middle now. Goal kick here. Fabio Borini. Oh, 
They've got a great understanding, this team. Just look at the passing. Barini! That was the opening that they've been working so hard to get, to get back on level terms. And you're right, Martin, they have worked extremely hard. Just let down at the, at the death there, what a miss. Good forward play from them. Well, he's treaded the pass through neatly. Trotton! He's blocked that well. Fabio Borini. It will be their throw. Aaron Ramsey. Nacho Monreal. Into the attacking third. And it's Arsenal holding a slender advantage as we count down towards half-time. And still a few questions for them to answer in this game. Yanuzai. Good position, they've worked this attack very well. <laughs> Into a quite a dangerous position now. Billy Jones. Through pass. Short passes, but they're keeping the ball. Barini! Oh, the header looked in. For all the world, but the goalkeeper somehow was able to keep it from crossing the line. To level it up now, oh, he's missed it, and that would have been the equaliser. Oh, what a chance, what a chance that was, and uh, I don't know whether he's going to get another in this match. Shokran Mustafi. Three minutes from the referee via the fourth official. That's the decision regarding added time. Well, they're in a good position here. That's really well done. Good defending. And that's half time. Well, they've done well in the first half. Second half underway for Arsenal. Pitch not quite wide enough for him there. Corne. On you go, says the referee to Sunderland. He'll need to try and get the ball back now. On to the attack now. He's tried that from long range. Oh, he had a real go. Well, you can't knock him. He was in the right place at the right time. Just couldn't... Uh... Provide the finishing touch. Jermaine Defoe. Well, the best way to silence this crowd, and you'll want to do it, is with a great performance. Nacho Monreal. Attacking now. Gets his foot in there. Well, the tackle there has led to a throw. Activity on the bench for the losing team. A substitute getting ready to come on. <laughs> Moving forward with some danger to the opposition. Now they're here. Sanchez! It's in! Time moment for them. They've got a firmer grip on the game now. They're two ahead. A goal from Alexis. And the way he's hit this one, it's flew off his boot to beat the keeper. Restarting at 2-0. Well, Oviedo. Ryan Oviedo. Sharp piece of attacking play from Sunderland. Foul called against Arsenal. Rash, Alan, reckless. Well, he's gone to ground, and whenever that happens, you're going to get penalised. Poor challenge. Well, the losing team have got to do something, and this is it, the substitution.
They've coped with it well defensively. Good forward play from them. Well, that's not so much an interception as a poor pass. Darren Gibson. Sunderland ready to make a move in terms of a substitution now. That looked dangerous until he made the interception. Sanchez. It's looking good, this move. Well, offside, and uh, it's not going to change the course of the game. Now those defenders will be pretty happy if those forwards continue to be quite as brainless as that. 20 minutes of the 90 still to play. It's Jermaine Defoe. Well, it's an important area to win back the ball, that. Mesut Ozil. Tackle goes in. Well, he's got support here. Oh, he's beaten his marker. Monreal! Gone for goal in spectacular style. Well, wow. I was expecting him to be wheeling away in celebration there. Oviedo. Fabio Borini. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. And it will go into the middle now. Sunderland really struggling to get back into the game. I think this is going to be kitchen sink time, Martin, now. Plenty of long balls into the box, trying to get on those knockdowns. We're closing in on the result here, and it looks as though it's going to be... A... The goalkeeper, it's his ball. It's 82 minutes played now. Wabi Kazri. Sunderland wondering whether they can go on and score from here. First touch was good, but he's got to work hard to keep the ball. This could be it. Welbeck! He's a great team player, Danny Welbeck, but he gets his share of goals for himself as well. And this is in typical Danny Welbeck fashion. Well, he's doubled up here with his second goal, and he took it in excellent style, just like the first one. Well, they've widened the margin now, 3-0 they lead. Sebastian Larsson attacking well here. Good pass, getting it forward. Cut off! Very good stop here. And here's the shot. Great work by the goalkeeper. The ball is his, and he's made sure he's protected it. And there's the final whistle. Arsenal have won this match. Just looking down, the manager's got a smile as wide as the pitch because it's been a near-perfect day for him and his team. Yeah, definitely. A clean sheets and uh, one or two goals into the bargain so they can move on with confidence. What a brilliant performance from this fella. Well, so often we think of his creative abilities, but a couple of goals here won the match for his team.